all <coughs> I just choked. Alrighty, I have a construction update for you guys today. Um, sorry, I lost my voice on the trip. That's exactly what happened there. Uh, so uh, today, the pump house is nearing complete on the exterior. I don't know what's going on in the interior anymore. I can't make out anything with the roof and walls up. Um, but nonetheless, the pump house is coming along. I'm hearing around mid-April. Um, second week of April, third week of April, we'll start seeing the purple slide super soaker get installed. Um, more parts for Tundra Twister have arrived. I was told that the gondolas are on site. I, um, I don't know if it's just because they look so massive under the white tarps that I can't picture those being the gondolas. Um, but I have been told that the gondolas are on site. Um, but, uh, I don't know. I'm going to take that with a grain of salt, to be honest right now. I'm going to take that with a, a big grain of salt because I, I just, like, I, I can't, picture those big white tubes being the gondolas um, unless they're stored somewhere else but I was told by a trusted person that they're on site so hey the gondolas potentially could be on site <laughs> Tundra Twister's um, construction site has been completely leveled from when I last did an update they are now installing what I assume is the op booth because um, a lot of electrical leads to there um, or it's the electrical room or a pump house whatever this ride's going to run off of um that's what's going there. Timber Kits also is down there in front of the Coca-Cola house. So again, you can trust it's going to be a really well-themed ride. Super excited about um, Timber Kits being involved in a lot of the Frontier Canada stuff, even the Snoopy's Racing Railway. Uh, so Snoopy's Racing Railway has made a lot of progress um, since I last filmed on Thursday. So holy crap. Um, but yeah, nonetheless, it's about 80% done, maybe 75, 70%. Maybe I'm a little overextending the percentage of the ride that's done. Um, you can see the little launch section covered in white there, the white tarp. They do that. It sh should be drive tires, but an interesting difference in this ride is this ride has a basement, unlike the one, um, elsewhere. So that's interesting. I don't know if that's going to be the power, uh, supply for the ride or a queue line. Cause it's got very, two large, very doors almost. If you look down there in the bottom of the station. So we'll keep an eye on that. I assume it would be the power, but the fact that the other version of it doesn't have that has me questioning. Um, but nonetheless, they're moving along really well. Again, they open soon. It looks like they're really far behind, but trust Wonderland gets stuff done. Um, there's a potential it could be delayed, but I always trust in Wonderland and getting their stuff done. Wonderland is working on a mountain refresh right now. So as you see right there, getting a lot of new roofing installed, refreshing the area. You can see some landscaping going on as well. Um, in and around where those like caribou um, are set up for Winterfest. Um, so yeah, really excited about that. It seems like Cedar Fair is pumping a lot of money into this park. And again, really excited about the 2025 season um, from what we're hearing. Leviathan has 2.5 trains on the track, maybe two. It's really hard to see. I cannot make out the storage area from where I fly my drone, unfortunately. Um, and I noticed that they started gutting um, the inside of the left side of front gate. So again, more signs um, of a potential reno coming or just a refresh. I'll be really disappointed if they just refresh front gate. I, I really will. I really will. Uh, but I could totally see them kind of like just installing an entire, like double the amount of kiosks to get into the park in this portion that they're working on. Again, you see infrastructure work going on off to the left of it as well. So we'll keep an eye on front gate. Again, we are predicting a 2024, 2025 reno. So again, I'll be really disappointed if it ends up only being a refresh, but thanks for watching guys. Hopefully you enjoyed today's video. Have a good one. Bye.